what's going on everybody I got the fluid for my transmission uh, it is a manual G56 so I went ahead and went with the Royal Purple Synchro Max so I'm gonna do the fluid change and the PTO cover today without further ado let's get to it so first thing that's a transmission drain plug right there it's gonna be a 14 millimeter hex so we want to take that off and drain the fluid into the drain pump. The PTO cover is right here. Um, let me get you guys set up and then we'll get right to it. By the way, the PTO bolts are an 11. So right here I am getting the old RTV off the side of the transmission. I'm using my hands and a razor blade. I'm trying to get it in bigger pieces so they don't fall into the transmission cavity right there. Um, take your time with this one. You don't want to get any of that junk in the transmission. getting really lucky over here that these are just peeling right off I'm just using my nail a little bit too these fine ones are the ones that are giving me some some problems so I just scrape at them with the razor blade and try to make sure they don't land inside the transmission And I'm rubbing them down with a degreaser too. So that new gasket and RTV will just mesh onto that perfectly. So almost there. Okay, now I'm going to show you the RTV gasket process. I'm going to start by putting a thin bead around it and then spreading it with my finger. I've made sure to clean my finger off. So let's keep that going. Here goes, 
running out of light here. Gotta speed this up a little bit. I went with the RTV black. Take that, like this, and line it up on here the best I can, and do the same thing on this other side. So here we go. Just making a mess here. There we go. All right, same thing with this side. to the undercarriage and start hand tightening some of these bolts on there getting it all dirty already all right let me get you guys set back up down there all right I'm gonna do one more wipe down Last little bit of stuff off of there. All right. I'm gonna grab the PTL cover. It's a Allen head, so here we go. Probably start. And then I'm going to get my torque wrench out. Okay. Just hand tightening for now. Always go in a star pattern. Let me get my torque wrench up. Okay, that's good. Then we head up to the top one. That one's good. So star pattern. Good. All right. 
okay. Last night I was rushing, made a big mistake. There's the TL cover. Oh, I gotta clean some stuff out. I gotta clean this up. And then I gotta put the rest of the fluid in there. I lost almost a quart yesterday because I didn't have the drain plug in there, so whoopsie on my part like I said I'll show you guys my mistakes too so that was a bad one because this stuff isn't cheap so I'm gonna go ahead and clean that up and then get back to it torque wrench torque this down which is the drain plug and then torque that which is the fill and then clean this all up and call it good do a test drive see how it feels um, I think I'm just I'm gonna wait to do the, the front diff here later um, when I do that one I'll also do the transfer case so yep all right Catch you back in a little bit. <laughs> so, drain plug, 22 foot pounds. That's good, alright. And then fill plug, 28. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that is the video. It's gonna finish out here with just me doing some cleaning up and uh, wiping down uh, the PTO cover and my front drive shaft there. Um, the test drive, wow, it was very quiet. The gear rollover and the, and the low RPMs um, pretty much disappeared there. And uh, it just seems to shift a lot smoother. Um, like I said, I went with the Royal Purple Synchro Max. There are other oils you could use on these G56s. For example, the M's Oil Synchro Mesh. Um, Chrysler does recommend the ATF4. Uh, it is on the manual uh, that comes with these things. And um, But G56 is made by Mercedes and they recommend other oils. Um, but definitely do your research, you know, don't just take it from me. I'm testing it out from the research that I've done online. Um, well, that's the video. If you like it, like it, um, comment, subscribe to the channel because there is a lot more to come with this pickup of mine. Um, yep, thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next one.